Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. I got a quick uh, tutorial for you today. Uh, I know it's been done a lot on YouTube. It's been shown, but quite frankly, every time that I need to redo mine, I'm tired of looking. So I figured I'd go ahead and make my own video, put it on my channel. Hopefully it helps you out. Hopefully it's a little uh, easier to find. And um, yeah, so uh, let's get right down to it. So uh, we're gonna work on the cam view. Um, so if you don't know what the cam view thumbnail is, that's this little guy right here. Um, you can customize that to what you want. So therefore we're going to go ahead and make our own. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to document and hit this little back. Well, hold, click and hold and drag it down to the black color that you have. Um, the reason why we do this is if you notice, if you take this circle and you put it behind here, it's alpha out. Um, if you were to leave it gray, it would have a gray box around here, and that's not what we want. Um, okay, so now we have our black background. So now we're going to be alpha out. Next thing we need is we need our model, our skull. So I already have one pulled up. It's this uh, funny looking pink unicorn that's sick. Um, probably because he saw himself in the mirror. Okay, so we're going to wait. I have all my sub tools here. I kind of want to make it easier, so I'm going to go hit merge visible and we're going to go to this. So we have just one and let's turn the floor on. Let's see. I want to make this a little bit bigger. So we're going to center this, go like that. And then we're going to hit home. Boom. You have it in the center. Um, you could also go and hit, if you go down to deformation and hit unify, that will also put it, will actually resize it too. So that's probably actually even better. So let's just go ahead and do that. And then we're going to go over to here. We're going to pull that shelf out. We're going to go to preferences, pull this out. This way we can see it constantly. And we're gonna go to cam view. And we're gonna to go to make cam view. Oops. I do not want that. So right here, make cam view. And it's gonna spin it, spin it, spin it. And voila, we have our cam view. Custom cam view for all your sculpting pleasures. And so now, we're gonna close this and I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna turn the magnifier now, document, put this back to gray. So now we're gonna to go to texture. And if you see here, it puts this little texture here. And we're going to export. Now this will be dependent on where you have your install. I have my install on a separate, but you're gonna to wanna to find your ZBrush installation folder. The mine is on D, Programs, Graphics, ZBrush, and this is 2022. I'm gonna to go to Z Startup and Cam View. I'm gonna change this to Photoshop. And here are all your different cam views. You can make as many as you want, obviously, and store them right here. I already have um, a unicorn here, but I'm gonna go ahead and save over top of it. And then I'm going to go to preferences, config, and we're going to store config. Okay. And we are going to close ZBrush. All right, ZBrush is back up and up. Oh, look, what? Oh no. Aha, just kidding. So we're gonna go to preferences, cam view, Next, scroll through them all until, boom, there's ours. And we could also go to preferences and view and change the size and voila. Now if we close ZBrush and bring ZBrush back up, there's our cam view, cam view thumbnail. So um, I'm not sure if 
that that's just the way I do it. I know that possibly there's something in the config that will bring it up the first time, but for some reason I always have to restart it a second time to get it up. But now every time I restart ZBrush, my cam view thumbnail will always be my custom thumbnail. I um, hope this was helpful. If it was helpful, please hit like, subscribe to my channel. It'd really help out. And um, if there's anything else you might need help on, um, you'd like to see demonstrated, uh, leave a comment below. And um, hopefully we'll see you soon. Finger Monday out.